This instruction, the first and least, will show the path your storm will take. <laughs> Small steps, Inquisitor. The last of the car. Okay, so this guy, I guess, is something dealing with potions. Even though he keeps saying, no, it's not potions. But that sounds exactly like where it is. Um, it, to create elemental damage to help me out. This guy sounds like he's all about traps. What are you all about? Or who, who, what is this? What, is, what are you doing here? Who knows? Near? Or here? I received a bird. It had a note. Now I am here. You're here to train me. Ah, that is it. The Inquisitor wishes to become more than Inquisitor. Perhaps he wishes to walk in shadow, even as he Ooh. is bathed in light. Ooh. To save life through inflicting death. Uh -huh. Childish notions. The profession of assassin <gasps> has no time for it. Ooh. Assassino! Your profession has my respect. I'm eager to learn. Really? We shall see. Oh, yes. Let me first say he does not want to be an assassin. Any more than he would wish to be a sword or a cudgel. Uh -huh. Such are the weapons of others. They lack intent. He must become his own assassin. There is a difference. Let me next say, death has nothing to do with it. Death is the payment, the byproduct. Our way is between life and death. It is a door through which he will send others. <laughs> I know of the Antivan crows and the bards of the game. Are you similar? They are servants. The Inquisition did not request a servant. They asked for the means. I am a trainer. And as such, I am not tethered. Some find that freedom unsettling. That is my servant. Is there a danger to this? The trite answer is that there is a danger to everything. But also a use. There is no physical cost, no corruption, only action. He may come to see others as mere things. That can be off-putting. Tell me the benefits. Our way is the sudden strike that overwhelms. The leap from shadow and back. We hit where and when it hurts most. In so doing, we send a message. Mm -hmm. No others invite death so efficiently. That is what the assassin offers. Oh, girl, you have me the second said assassin. I'm ready to start learning. He is willing. Will it always be so? There are tasks, processes, ways to train the mind and body. They require simple motions, first steps. Then we shall see what he may become. Oh, wow, I already got that one done. The profession of assassin <laughs> requires more than I have seen, more than has been done. Uh, wait, yeah. I'm ready to start learning. He has his instruction, yet he repeats. A poor start. Wait. I thought I... Wait. Do I not have the thing? Attempt this way the assassin. How do I get this? I need death root, goddammit. Damn it! Uh, kill guild leaders in the towns of the East Side Hills, the Flats, Crestwood. Okay. Ah, uh, sounds badass. Cool. Very cool. So we'll be doing that for sure. Because I know that you had your own little specializations and whatnot you could go into further with your class that you could choose. Um, I, so I don't know if that's going to be different, like if the three will be different for each class I, or not. Because they kind of seem very varied enough that they might be able to, but... Like, I'm pretty sure you could switch it up where you could become an assassin, if need be. My throne... Kind of nice. We're not ready to sit on her just yet. So I think we just sit on the damn thing. 
party starts a quest, doesn't it? Let me see. Sit in judgment. Someone being held in sky. Maybe we we'll do that here in a minute. Here, let's uh check out my war council real quick. See what's going on, and I think we'll go ahead and pass some judgment then. Kind of getting vibes back from Fable Three, but I get the feeling it's gonna be a lot better than that. A lot. Okay. Right. So we've got a point. Um, so let's have a look. Uh, let's see, mythology developed by your Legion Blade Master grants increased XP. Mage schematics, rogue schematics. All right, what about this? Optimal cutting grants five extra herbs. Eh. Grand significant increase to discovery range. Eh, it's not bad, I guess. Ooh. That sounds pretty good. 50% gain additional of tier 1 herbs. Okay. Wait, wait, was that Dev Tans I saw? Ah, oh, want that one. 4 points in and cat. God damn it. Connections. These few will place just as care for you, the other. Okay. First of all. Okay, so discounts. Discounts. Right. Merchants eager to win favor from the Inquisition will get access to special offers for. Ooh. And this one. Challenge increase. <gasps> That's how I get it, son of a bitch. Yet. Oh crap! I need that. All right. So, uh, Dory's request. Uh, Dorian's leads were effective. The Inquisition found several locations where these Venatori could be hiding. Advanced camps. Um, purpose unknown. If you wish to deal with these mages, I'm certain Dorian would be pleased. I'll mark the locations on your map should you pass by any on your travels. Get some influence. And more of Haven. Ambassador Montilet. Please assure the Inquisition of my deepest regards. Work on the memorial. Proceed without incident. And it was unveiled to a crowd of almost a thousand. May it stand forever as a testament to the tendency of the faith in times of great trial. Marquis Jerusalem. We got a grip thing. Okay. Oh, Lord. There's a lot. Gain Orzmer's friendship. We have received a message from Orzmer knowing an ancient darkspawn threatens Theodos. King Haramont officially declares his support for the Inquisition. Josephine. Beautiful! Um, I would advise taking a delegation to Orzmar as soon as possible to spend... Yes. At your service. Definitely. Get the Dwarven help. Where was... Shit. This one? Fuck. Why can I not do this one? Hmm. Whatever. Um, Fallenmire resources. Blood Lotus and Dawn Lotus are both found. Fallenmire, the area, is also known for Summerstone and Blue Patrol. Now the Inquisition has established a camp in the region. They could instruct the men to seek out these resources and send anything they find to Skyhold. Short time. Oh, one nine minutes. We'll wait. It's really short. What about this one? Hinterland resources. Same thing, pretty much, right? Yeah. We'll wait. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna wait. I want Josephine there. The shadows over dinner room. Oh, hell. Okay, well, Josephine's locked out of this one anyway, so this is good. And Inquisitor, the first thing's first, an apology. 
I offered the rebel mages safe harbor in Ferelden only to have them drive my uncle out of his own town. This sounds like Alistair. So I'll admit I wasn't in the best of mood. Yep, best of moods when I first met you. I just wanted everyone out of Redcliffe. Didn't care who was responsible for the, for what. Uh, now I wish I'd done otherwise. Isn't that always the way? These cultists, Venatori, I think they, I think they're called. We have we have them in the royal palace, or so I'm told, like rats. But with magic and nasty sneers, I don't know what they're up to, but I need to find them and drive them out. Since the Inquisition knows all about them, I'm hoping you'll help. Something, something, grateful, something. Wait, did you just write that? You scribes do this on purpose, don't you, King Alistair Theron? <laughs> so let's see, with Liliana, um, she can do it. Oof, significant shorter time. It takes two hours, nearly three, but then it's over three. Anyway. Um, I have just the agent in mind for this, allow me to send her to Denarim to quietly hunt down the Venatory spies, or Cullen, send forces to aid in the manhunt. Not only should we help, but everyone should see us too. It brings up a good point, but I kind of like the idea of us just going in there quietly. Because I, th I think it would be better, because, you know, if the public finds out that they're spies, that could be bad. At least that's what I believe. Inquisitor. We'll do it. This is my thinking on it, at least. Power for a price. What the hell is this? <sighs> oh, you can do with the shorts, too. Formal document with impeccable, yada yada. Uh, it is time the Inquis Inquisitioner commands a small kingdom. It is time to exercise the weight of his influence there. Of his, I'm sorry, of his influence. There remain uninvolved and uncommitted lords and ladies, uh, bonds and arles, where they cannot be engaged with plight or passion. They can be compelled through merchant means, but there must be a display. Make it known that the Inquisition has weight and the boons and the this God damn it. dispensations of the powerful will be open to you. Thereafter, he need he need not curry influence. He can simply buy it. He's the fairest, the representative. With Cullen, a grand march. If we are to show weight, show the legion that you command. Do not display. We will show your reach by simply being where it is most. But no, fit of your own. Just play the. Uh, I like Cullen's thing for sure. To work. Because, like, for these people who haven't already thought that, you know, they should join us, I think having our armies come in, mind you, we don't really have much of an army right now, <coughs> but I, I just believe that with a real show of force, I'm like, oh, well, you know, hmm. Might want to get behind this. Just, just, just maybe. Yeah. What the hell? What's happening? Cutscene. Uh. Well, there he showed up. <laughs> I, I like how it showed me a cutscene of people I already met with. Nice. Oh, what's this? Way with the. Oh. It's a fist ship. Alright, but I do want to do this, like I said. So, let me save. Again. Very interested to see what kind of options I have here. Sit! Oh, I got, got quiet too. Impressive, is it not? Fit for a leader, meant to show influence and the burden of it. It is where the Inquisition will sit in judgment, where you will sit in judgment. Who will I be judging exactly? Those who have done wrong. You will know of them, at the very least. All this presumes they have survived their initial encounter with you, of course. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Still more lives in my hands. It's usual. You are a beacon of law, Inquisitor, as others retreat from responsibility. 
But this needn't be bloody. Agreed. The Inquisition's sovereignty is derived from the allies who validate it. You are both empowered and bound. Mm. Justice has many tools. If their application is clever, execution may even seem merciful by comparison. Well, let's go. Is there anyone I should judge? Take the throne when you're ready. We will bring him before you. Just one for now? Well... Alright. That's it. Oh, I got quiet again. What was with my gut there? Why is it all puffy at the bottom? It's weird. Alright, what you got, Josephine? This was a surprise. After you return from the bogs, we discover this man attacking. What the the building with a goat. <laughs> what? 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 Mavran the Under. He feels slighted by the killing of his Avar tribesmen, oh. who repeatedly attacked you first. What should we do with him? Where should he go? Dude, I love your helmet. With a goat? You're a chieftain of the Avar. Will your attacks persist? <laughs> a courtroom? Unnecessary. You killed my idiot son. And oh. I answered, as is my custom. By with throwing goats? Your holdings with goat's blood. Okay. Don't look at me. <laughs> no foul. You meant to murder Tevintus, but got feisty with your inquisition. A red-headed mother guarantees a brat. <laughs> Do as you've earned, Inquisitor. My clan yields. My remaining boys have brains still in their heads. <laughs> so, it's customary that when someone loses in your culture to throw goats at the victor's walls? No, I don't want them out of my lands, but... Because I feel like they could actually be of use. Be of use. Be of use, like I mentioned earlier. I don't know. He could go in that... What's it called? A gibbet? What is a gibbet? I don't even know what a gibbet Chief is. Chief Movran. You'll be placed in a gibbet to serve as an example to... Someone. Then... Probably released. Gibbet? <laughs> Gibbet? Gibbet? <laughs> I don't know what a gibbet is. Personally, I don't think I should have killed him or anything. I mean, we have more people? <sighs> I just wish I knew what a gibbet was. I wish I could have recorded Oh, crap. Ferelden has given him to us as an acknowledgement of your aid. Ooh. The formal charges are apostasy, attempted enslavement, and attempt in assassination on your own life, no less. Hey, Saint. Tevinter has disowned and stripped him of his rank. You may judge the former magister as you see fit. Huh. I remember what would have happened to Thedas if his treachery had succeeded. I couldn't save my son. Do you think my fate matters to me? Will you offer nothing more in your defense? You've won nothing. The people you saved, the acclaim you've gathered. You'll lose it all in the storm to come. Render your judgment, Inquisitor. Uh-huh. Oh. Ooh. Oh, damn. This is actually interesting. I like this. This is a really tough choice, because... I, I don't like the idea of him going back to Redcliffe at all, just in case he tries it again. I highly doubt it. We could kill him, but... We could imprison him, but... We could do this, which... I like a lot because it's beneficial. So, I'm going to do this. Your magic was theoretically impossible, Alexius. I could use people like you. 
Your sentence is to serve, under guard, as a researcher on all things magical for the Inquisition. No execution. <sighs> Very well. Boy, I like how I keep getting approval and disapproval from my people, too. Ugh, it's gonna be fun. I was really hoping I could, uh... Get the goat guys clan on my side. I mean, God, did you see how big his son was? I really, really... Really! He could have used someone like that on the battlefield. Let's see, what is this? Timely intervention. There are reports of right there. Oh. Okay. Helicima? Cullen. Let go. It's forward. And down here, uh, no. Okay. Let's go see what's going on with Cullen real quick. Cullen! Where you at, buddy? Probably up there. That's where it showed him, at least. <sighs> I do wish we could have recruited him. Kind of like how we got... Satan-looking guy. I, I just think he would have been better suited that way in... Honestly, I didn't want to kill him. He threw goats. My dagger was gone. Just yeah. He 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 threw goats at my walls. Seriously, what could he possibly hope to do? Few. I know someone took it right off my belt, but I can't recall who. Cole. Hey, Colin. You okay? Inquisitor. I found where the Red Templars come from. Theron Fall Redoubt. What's that? The knights were fed Red Lyrium until they turned into monsters. Samson took over after their corruption was complete. How do you know Samson? He was a Templar in Kirkwall until he was really? expelled from the Order. I knew he was an addict, but this... Red Lyrium is nothing like the Lyrium given by the Chantry. Its power comes with a terrible madness. The Red Templar's swarming haven were proof enough. We cannot allow them to gain strength. The Red Templars still require Lyrium. If we find their source, we can weaken them and their leader. Yeah, what is your plan? Where do we begin? Caravans of Red Lyrium are being smuggled along trade roads. Investigating them could lead to where it's being mined. If you confront them, be wary. Anything connected to Samson will be well guarded. Okay. I do like the whole idea here of uh, cutting them off with the knee. Sounds good to me. Okay. Groovy, groovy, groovy. Um, but like I said, uh, I think I've got the way to the uh, desert opened up. Well, we can hear the wind going through. That's pretty cool. That is very cool. What's up? Um, but let's see. I hope there's a lot more of those um, times where I get to judge. That That's pretty cool. I like that idea a lot. Like I liked it back in Fable 3, but Fable 3 just shed the bed on that for the most part. Which is very disappointing. Very. I mean, really, the Fable series has continued to shit the bed. Which really sucks. I mean, everyone's still waiting for Peter Monlu's acorn. I am. Where the hell is the... Uh... Look at her, look at her, okay. Really? You did not notice? I had no idea Lady Beverly was one of your people. You might have told me before I embarrassed myself. 
planes. Okay, so. Cullen, um, our spies looked into the breakdown of contract between Val Royal and Imperial Army forces in the Dales. Troops on both sides agreed to cease hostilities, then retreated to their camps to wait um, the outcome of peace talks. What occurred after the withdrawal is a mystery. The last com communion, I guess, whatever, communique, um, from Gaspard's marshal reported a rash of desertions. After that, silence agreed that this warrants for the investigation. Do what you will. My agents will then support Liliana. So, I'm going to Colin here. Or, you can only go and call. Do it. Uh, we have established an outpost in the Exalted Plains. It's got Harding is en route and waiting for their orders. Not yet. Uh, liberate that. Two successor. Oh, I miss these. I think. Never mind. Uh, Commander Cullen, scouts are reporting a number of travelers entering the western approach. Surprising, since the place is blighted, it's a blighted desert with no trade routes. Uh, more surprising, no one is leaving. It bears investigating. Like Captain Ryland. Do it. I've got all this power. I need to use it. Commander, we've established foot on the western approach per orders. Um, already one skirmish with the Venator. Ooh, but no casualties. Requesting reinforcements. The term Blighted Desert doesn't do this place justice. Lieutenant Harding. Yeah, I want to go. Uh, let's take Bull. Solus again. Huh. Yeah, give me black wall. Confirm. So now we've actually got two other areas open to us. Woohoo! I can't wait till I'm strong enough where I can actually fight one of those damn dragons, though. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Cannot wait! This place kind of looks like the last DLC that you could go to for uh, Dragon Age 2. Look at that background. Kind of cool if it was. We shall see. We'll see just how bad of a desert this place is, too. Like the desert from uh, the Charter 3, perhaps. <laughs> a lot of people didn't like that section. I actually did. I felt it was very akin to the, you know, snow-capped mountains that you traverse in two. Welcome to the Western Approach. Thank you. We've cited warden activity to the southwest, Ooh. but no one's been close enough to figure out what they're doing. Between the sandstorms and the vicious wildlife, we haven't made it far out here. One of my men got too close to a poison hot spring and gave me a slightly delirious report of a high dragon flying overhead. In short, this might just be the worst place in the entire world. Be careful out there. Yeah, let's flirt with her. Are you worried about me? Someone has to be. I'm trying yes. not to die. I don't want to deliver that report to Skyhold. We intercepted a venatory messenger and uh persuaded him to give up the orders he was carrying. We have them here. This entire place. It just feels like something's not right. Be careful. Sure. You know, what? I'm gonna actually switch this up. I want Inquisitor, if you have a moment. Oh, yeah. Sure, what's up? What is it? See for yourself, sir. Okay. Alright, uh... Change of plans. I don't want Solus. I guess I have to pick them all again. Black wall and... Give me Dorian, actually. Because... I don't know, I just feel like if there's these uh, Venatori guys here, then... We might want someone else. So, Dorian, what is your special skill? Necromancer. Dorian is well versed in spells that 
by and manipulates uh, faith spirits practice that does not have the same stigma that defends her perium as it does elsewhere in Thetis. Horror, you only spirits fear that terrify all enemies within the area. Let's see, blinding terrium.